A large amount of rain in a short period of time triggered flash flooding in Spearfish last month. Now that time has passed, the community is coming together to help one another the best way they can. In tonight's Eye on Kelloland, Tyler Lauder shows how the Black Hills town is cleaning up and moving forward. Spearfish was hit with a downpour on June 23rd, just days after several inches of rain had already fallen on the community. Our topography in Spearfish, there's a lot of hills, uh, a lot of down uh, streets that uh, have steep fall off. You know, it really created a big problem for us on that day. And First responders were quickly on the scene. Those who were off duty also got to work to be full hands on deck. Once the rain let up, locals were jumping at the opportunity to help their community. Immediately following the event, even the Monday after, we had volunteers walking into the chamber office, what, how can I help? And that vibe has continued throughout the community. So uh, there's been a lot of neighbors helping neighbors tear out carpet up in neighborhoods. Um, they're just rolling up their sleeves and, and helping each other out. The Spearfish Community Foundation also stepped up to the plate. So the Spearfish Flood Relief 2023 donation drive, the fund, is actually formulated in order to assist those who are most affected by the flood and, and the storm within the last couple of weeks. And as the city of Spearfish is looking to build up funds and help out those in need, organizations such as the Red Cross are still housing people that lost property in this situation over at Spearfish High School. We have it set up uh, for clients to come in, uh, also provide them feeding and uh, mental health, health services, and spiritual care. Um, we've been able to go out into the community, do assessments to the damage so that uh, we can apply our resources to where they're needed. The Spearfish community really showed its true colors through the compassion levels that we have, the altruistic uh, spirits that we have, and the collaboration in which people in the community came together in order to get the donation drive activated quickly. As people continue to repair the flood damage, their spirits are high, helping one another. I appreciate the community uh, just reaching out, trying to do the best they can to raise money and, and uh, donate where, where they can uh, give money or give their time. With Eye on Kelloland, I'm Tyler Lauder. Now, if you'd like to assist with the community funds, we have links provided on our website.